Okay, out in the waterfowl wildlife refuge area near my home. Walking distance, really. You want to walk a couple miles. I'm a couple miles in. Here's a rare scene here. It's a swan. It's a male. He's all alone. But that just tells me one thing. If he was looking for a female, he wouldn't be here. So he already has one. She could be in this brush back here anywhere, sitting on her eggs. They, they, uh, they're the first ones on the nest about this time of year. He'll stay out here and guard relentlessly until those babies hatch. So I'm gonna hope that the flooding wasn't too much for them and she's still around somewhere. She's doing okay. I don't see any, I don't see her. He keeps looking over to my left. See, she might be over here somewhere. Hopefully she's okay. Normally what they'll do is they'll find a place in the reeds and uh, they like to stay in the water because the they have to stay on their nest. They will not leave that nest or anything. And if the uh, they're attacked by coyotes or foxes, they'll they'll defend themselves to the death. They'll defend that egg to the death. So I'm hoping everything's okay. He's a this is a beautiful specimen. He looks really really healthy. A little closer. He looks really healthy. There's probably a good food supply in here. And right across the, behind me, it's a cornfield they plant just for the animals at the refuge area. Another great find. Like I said, I just hope everything's okay with his mate. Because he will stay with her the whole season, even if she dies. These are really, really crazy animals. Really crazy cool. Duck out. in the wild. Ducks, they're really skittish.